Good afternoon. Day 29 on the Appalachian Trail. A stormy night last night. Turned into a really awesome morning today. Rained, well, it started storming about three, three o'clock in the morning last night. Thunder, lightning, wind, the whole deal. And that passed and it turned into a steady rain late into the morning, so waited the rain out and got off to a later start than normal. But it wasn't but a maybe a mile in or less than a mile across the road and there were some guys giving trail magic there for breakfast. So I had a and you saw a picture of it. I had a bacon egg cheese sandwich, two bags of chips and an apple. Saw a little waterfall, that that stream, little creek that I slept next to turned into that waterfall. So got to see a waterfall. Got some trail magic for breakfast. Got to cross that bridge and that big river. I'm not sure what river it was, but that was kind of cool. Walked up a off ramp <laughs> of the highway, which was officially part of the trail, and then got back in the woods. And I tell you, once back in the woods, it turned into this monstrous uphill. I don't know how what what the elevation the elevation change is, but for the last couple two two and a half hours, it's just been going steady uphill and we're still going. So I'm gonna cut this short before I pass out. I'm not sure what the plan is, how many miles a day, but. I'll let you know that later. So, I will check back in in a little while. So I had mentioned that coming out of the Smokies was a huge deal for me. Milestone moment. Let me explain why. In one of the previous videos, I mentioned uh, the family trips down to the Smokies and to Gatlinburg. And I specifically mentioned coming down here last year after my daughter graduated from college and the whole family came down to watch her graduate, of course. And then we got a cabin up on top of a mountain. We rented it for the rest of the week. And it was me and my wife, my, uh, 
son and daughter, daughter-in-law, mom and dad, and mother-in-law. And we had rented that cabin up on top of the mountain and there was a deck off the back of the cabin that overlooked the, the Smokies. And at the time we were all down there, I had already announced my plans to through hike the Appalachian Trail. And so it was, uh, you know, always kind of in the back of my mind there, even while we were on that trip, that family trip. And I would stand out on that deck and I would look out over the mountains, the Smokies, and I would think to myself, <laughs> is there any way possible I can hike all the way through those mountains? And that question, it was, it was very present in my thoughts and in my mind that whole time we were there. And I, we had a great time, don't get me wrong, but that thought was there. And every time I would look at over those mountains, I, my, my brain would go back to that thought, is there any way I could do that? Well, I did it. <laughs> and so that's why reaching the end of the Smoky Mountains, in, and I did it in seven days, putting that second half of that permit in that box and exiting the Smoky, that's why it was such a big deal to me. Because I think back to that, standing on the deck and thinking to myself, can I do it? Well, the answer is yes. So I did it, <clears throat> excuse me, I did it. And it's a major, major accomplishment. Really boosts the confidence for the rest of the AT going all the way to Katahdin. camp for the night groundhog creek shelter a little over eight miles today uh tough climbing uh steep descent too it's just a tough day of climb of uh of hiking but it's been a, a peculiar day uh, a lot of unusual things uh we saw today so it's been fun rained on and off all afternoon got the rain jacket on here but glad to be in camp i'm gonna get some hot food in my belly snuggle into the sleeping bag and stay warm tonight it's supposed to get pretty chilly so but just wrapping it up for uh today and i look forward to uh, uh what the trail uh throws at me tomorrow so appreciate y'all god bless y'all thank you for watching again and we will see you back on trail tomorrow <laughs>